So you know when you're at camp and you've got half of your beer left and you want to save it for the next morning? No, nobody saves beer, do they? You know when you've got a can of pop on your camp and you really wish that you bought a bottle? Well, problem solved. I bought this can lid that turns it into a bottle of Timu for just 98p. And now if I take a can and I wish I'd taken a bottle, I can just turn it into one. And this is the danger of Timu. You see items like this on there and you start to think of uses for them rather than thinking of what items you need and then looking for them. I've no idea why I bought that and I've got seven or eight other items that I don't really have any idea why I bought them, but I thought I'd show you them anyway. If you haven't heard of Timu yet, it's a little bit like AliExpress. They've got an app and they've got a website and there's thousands and thousands of really cheap products on there. On Timu though, it's all free delivery. The stuff that I ordered all came together in one parcel and it took just six days to arrive. So yeah, as well as this kind of bottle top, bottle lid thing for 98 pence, I've got a few other items to show you. They're pretty much all rubbish, apart from one of them, which I think could have a good use or potential use. One of them, I just totally ordered the wrong thing. I just didn't understand the listing. And another thing, I got the wrong item and it was Timu's fault, but I'll tell you more about that shortly. So tying in with the sort of drinks and bottles theme, I got three of these. Now this is a collapsible silicon funnel with a little loop on there to put a carabiner on or tie it onto something. It's not a shiwi, obviously. It could be a hiwi if you've got a small bottle and you want to use it as a pee bottle, but let's not go there. Now again, I saw these and thought, what could I use them for? I got three of them for 88p. So if you're looking for a collapsible silicon light blue funnel, hit me up. Basically, I thought with these, when I'm on my camps, I usually take a smart water bottle and my big aluminium bottle. So I drink from that, have it on my shoulder strap. And then this is obviously for carrying extra water and refilling this. And they're both really small lids and it can be quite awkward sometimes to fill them up. So with this funnel, it weighs next to nothing. I can just slot that in there. That bit slots nicely into a smart water bottle and it gives you a much bigger target basically. Next, I've got a multi-use item and it's a, a charging cable or a USB cable. So it's got a normal USB connector on one end, but on the other end, you've got a choice of three things or three connectors you can use. We've got a lightning cable for Apple iPhones and Apple devices. We've got a USB-C connection or a old, I think it's USB type A or something like that. A lot of older items use that. And being a sort of outdoorsy, wild campery type person, we do like multi-use items. So I can take that on my camps, plug that end into my power bank and then charge a few of my devices through that, my phone and my GoPro batteries at the same time, for example. And that was only £1.78, so it's worth a go. And I'd say that's probably a metre long, so plenty long enough to plug into your power bank and still use your phone or whatever you're charging at the same time. On the flip side of that, this is the item that Timu got wrong. This is a really short, lightweight cable. It's got a like carabiner type keyring type thing there. And then the cable folds in on itself. So you've got USB on one end and USB-C on the other end. I actually ordered a lightning version of this for charging my phone and they just sent the USB-C. So when I opened the parcel or the package, saw that it was the wrong one, I just went straight onto the app, went onto my order and you can report anything that's missing or incorrect. So I reported that they sent the wrong one of these. They asked me to upload a photo and then they just sent me a refund without having to send this one back. So I don't know if it's because I'm a new customer and it's my first order or if it's just something that they do because you've obviously sent the photo, proved that it's the wrong item and it's probably going to cost them more to post this back and post another one out than it would be just to write this off and, you know, call it quits, I guess. So I've now got a mini short um, USB-C cable that I will probably use for something. It's just not the one that I wanted. That one was quite expensive as well for Timu. That was £3.49. So the next thing I got, and this is the one that was my fault, I went on the listing for this and on all the photos it shows a nice sturdy box with a load of foam inside it and a load of sort of bushcrafty outdoorsy survival bits of kit inside it and there's a couple of photos of it with that kit. So at £2.69 I thought I'll grab one of those and we'll just see what you get with it and see if it's any good. And it turns out you don't get anything with it. It's just a box. Now it probably did say somewhere on the listing that content's not included or whatever, but who's got time to read listings when you're talking about a couple of quid? And why would you advertise an empty box as a hike in a bushcraft box? I have no idea. 
So I've also got an orange box with some foam in it that I don't really know what to do with. Maybe transport eggs to camp or something. So next up, this is the one that I think I will find a use for and it's a magnetic hook that you can use on your tents or tarps or whatever you want. So you get the top bit that goes on one side of your tent or tarp fabric and this just clips on with a magnet and then you've got a hook there. It comes with this carabiner clip. Now the carabiner is pretty rubbish so I would swap that out but it's really really strong. If you're pulling it straight, I've had my luggage scales on this and it took just over five and a half kilos of weight or force to pull that directly apart. If you twist it, it does come apart really easily and that's kind of what you want, but it's that direct pull that really has got some strength in it. So I'm thinking I might get another one of these to put like a washing line up or something from my tent to a tree or across my tent. Um, you could use it to add extra guy lines to tarps and tents or loads of different uses really. And that was £3.7p. I also grabbed one of these pillows. Now I think this is the same as the ones that you get in a lot of the supermarkets. I think this is a different shape to the one that I got from Tesco actually. It's more rectangular and not as thick I don't think. The Tesco one's more of an oval shape. It's worth having even if it's just a double up an existing pillow to give you some extra height I think because it is pretty, I'd say that's probably, what, seven or eight centimetres thick? Weighs hardly anything, and for £1.77, you might as well just throw one in your rucksack. Another thing I got was one of these foldable, collapsible water bottles. So you can fold these up, it's a little bit like the bag that you get with a Sawyer filter. It takes up hardly any room. Now the mistake I made with this one is I didn't look at the attachment, I was hoping it'd be like a screw fit, so that a water filter could fit to it, but it's actually the holes on the bag side and then the screw is on the lid. So it's kind of reversed to what I've had before. You've got a dodgy carabiner clip on it. So yeah, don't really know why I bought that one either. So it cost me 16 quid for those bits and pieces. I think, you know, the majority of them are okay. I did, hands up, get a bit carried away on the app and on the website and just started adding random things just out of curiosity really. Like I say, a lot of it is really cheap and you just start adding things to your basket, but they do all add up. Let me know in the comments if you've had a look around on Timu yet, if you bought anything, how you found it, or if you use my link to sign up, there's a little reward bonus. I think you get two pound added to your account if you sign up using the link. So give it a go and let me know how you get on.